Hello all, welcome to Mobile Testing YouTube channel. I got a new AWS instance with uh, Open Light Speed server hosting my WordPress website. I installed the WordPress setup in this IP address which is highlighted here, the old IP. And then what I did is I stopped the instance and then tried to start again. Since I haven't, I didn't assign any elastic IP to the instance, uh, my website address changed from this to this new IP address. So when I try to hit this new IP address in a browser, it is showing me a 404 error and you can see it says Lightspeed web server. This website is hosted on that. So I'm trying to solve this problem to ensure that when I hit this new IP address, my WordPress blog shows up. To do that, first we have to log in into the AWS instance and then change the directory to, let me zoom in and change the directory to user local lsws conf. Once you are here, you will find a file called httpd underscore config dot conf. This is the file you have to edit. So we, we have to give sudo command to edit this file. So when you get inside this file, you can see that as we scroll down, this specific IP address listed over here is my old IP address, which is 13.126.27.167. We have to change this IP address to the new IP address in order for my website to work. So there are two, three places where the old IP is listed. One is here, the other one over here, and the third one is in this place. So I'm planning to edit all these files, all these uh, IP address with a new IP address. So. I'm inside, I'm using a Vim editor, so I have to click on I in order to edit the file. So one place is done. Let me paste the new IP address here also. And then the last location is this place. Once I place the IP address over here, hit escape button and then colon WQ exclamatory mark. Once you do that, this file is saved. Now let me open and try to load the new website URL and you can still see it is showing a 404. Uh, we have to restart the AWS instance, the open light server basically and not the instance itself. The command to restart open light server is this. So it says permission denied. Let me restart it as sudo user. So this has, we should have restarted the server. Let us go and check the website again. You can see that my website started loading and you can see the title bar ch getting changed to open light speed just another way wordpress website let me open a new tab and then hit the same url again it is a bit slow but it is actually loading let me check the network this actually loading. Let me go stop the server and then start it again. Do a clean uh, start, start, stop. Then we'll see how if that helps to speed up the website. And the command to do that is okay. Again, I have to run it as a sudo user. Let me stop the server first and then start it. 
so you can see that the server started successfully now let us go and try to reload the website again so now you can see my website started loading instead of throwing a 404 error uh, the CSS and other things aren't loaded yet I have to fix that separately um, thanks for watching the video please subscribe to my youtube channel